The NBA draft is right around the corner. It's tomorrow. The Suns have a 14% chance of landing the number one overall pick with the New York Knicks and the Cleveland Cavaliers. So, my question to you, Kent. If the Suns get the number one overall pick, is that a best case scenario for you? I think it is for the Suns. Certainly, I you know you don't want the number one pick because of what it usually signifies is that you stunk mm -hmm, the year mm -hmm. before, and obviously the sun, Suns stunk again for whatever the fifth straight year. But I want the number one pick. I, okay. I, I understand there's a question between Zion Williamson and Ja Morant. Mm -hmm. I get it. They need the point guard. It'll be tempting, but I think Zion is so good. He's your power forward for the next 10 years. I, yeah, I welcome that number one pick. I would celebrate it if I'm the Suns, but you feel that way? I don't feel that way, actually. <laughs> I feel like best case for the Suns would be number two overall, because that way you don't have that pressure of taking Zion, because Zion, their question marks, where is he going to play, which position? Sure, he could be a power forward, but I feel like the Suns already have that unit there. The one piece they're missing is that point guard. And if you take John Morant number one overall over Zion Williamson, that's scary. See, that's I, so take scary. Zion, I take Zion Williamson, 6'7", 280. To me, there's no question where he mm -hmm, plays, mm -hmm. anywhere he wants. He's not a guy who's going to go out and handle the ball, obviously, but he's, he's a power forward. Mm -hmm. And I think if you add him, your chances of getting a, a point guard and free agency okay. increase that much more, especially with the hires that they've made, you know, with, with the, the head coach. Uh, you know, Monty Williams has a good reputation mm -hmm. in the league. The, the front office is now settled. Maybe taking Zion makes a free agent feel that much more comfortable about signing with the Suns. Uh, whereas, you know, how long, it's, how long has it been since we said that? Oh, been a while. <laughs> well, worst case scenario, the Suns could end up with the seventh overall pick and... That would not be good. That would not be yeah. good. Uh, it's Matt Wellhelm, Kent Summers. Have a good afternoon.